I was born on Fossil Down Station, where my ancestors came from. I grew up very much one with the land. We've shared this land with everybody, with a generous spirit, despite the atrocities that have happened. We've announced uh, more than $650 million in roads, water and other infrastructure in the north. And that rhetoric of jobs, jobs, jobs is an illusion. How are we as Australians letting our country be developed? To whose benefit, to whose interest? You know, really, we're being used. We either had to take the deal or suffer the consequences of losing any sort of capacity to control the development. Someone is going to mine that country. Surely we can get some local people trained up into that. It's a 47-year mine line. It's an intergenerational opportunity. Please, can you just speak to us like we actually have half a brain? Why do so many Kimberley children feel that the only option they have is to take their own life? Aboriginal Australia doesn't want to go into your backyard. It doesn't want to disturb you. It doesn't want to exploit your resources or your privacy or your, your inheritance. Aboriginal people don't want to do that to white Australia. Whereas every single day, Aboriginal people are facing that dilemma. Give it time and we wonder why. Do what we can, laugh and we cry.